Resident doctors in Nigeria public hospitals began an indefinite strike on Monday, August 2, over the grievances that include the delayed payment of salaries and allowances. Doctors' union said as the country faces rising COVID-19 infections, Nigerian doctors frequently strike over what they say are poor conditions of service. Last year, they walked out of their jobs three times, including over demands for an allowance for treating coronavirus patients. Dr. Roland Aigbovo, treasurer of the Nigerian Medical Association Abuja chapter, said some members were owed salaries of up to 10 months. Some of our members have been owed salaries of up to 10 months, some up to eight months at the state tertiary institution. And you believe that as we speak, what I get and other health workers is 5,000 hours hazard allowance, considering the most hazard we are exposed to. This, we believe that even federal government is playing uh, politics with it, with the issue of the improved hazard allowance, which is not, which is not proper. Thinking about the third wave and the Delta variant. But the truth of the matter is that there's no better time to say we want to proceed on the strike action, because we can only give our best if all the enabling environment is provided. And that enabling environment include our welfare, which borders on remuneration that is due us. But they need to consider the plight of the masses. People go to government hospitals to access cheap services. If they're not there, who would take care of them? The doctors may be justified in their action, but they need to rethink their position because of the plight of the masses. And I think that's the core of their profession. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.